Cost-effective ways of generating, transmission and distribution of energy with minimal losses are required to provide its rational use. To do this, one should exclude all the factors from power grids that lead to occurrence of losses. One of such factors is phase lag of the current flowing when there is an inductive load, as the load in the industrial and municipal power grids are usually of highly inductive nature. Power factor correction systems are designed to compensate for a total phase shift by introducing a phase advance in some network nodes. This reduces the current flowing through the networks and hence reduces parasitic losses in active conductors and distribution equipment. The required phase advance is created by connecting the parallel supply network to special corrective capacitors. To maximize the effectiveness of the correction circuit, it should be connected as close as possible to inductive load. Reactive power correction system reduces reactive component of the current flowing through the supply. When the nature of the load is changed, the correction circuits must be accordingly adjusted. It is usually carried out by automated correction systems, which perform stepwise connection or disconnection of individual correction capacitors. In the end, power factor correction allows you to reduce power consumption by reducing the reactive power in the system and thus reduce the cost of electricity consumed. High power factor provides more efficient use of distribution networks, since a high useful power will flow through a network while the total power will remain the same. Power factor correction can also improve voltage stability. Due to reduction of the current flow, the cable cross-section can be reduced as well, or additional power can be transmitted by a constant cross-section cable in the existing system. Transmission losses are reduced as transmitting and switching devices operate with a lower current, and hence, ohmic losses are reduced.